Hey, it's Tom from WPWithTom.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to import a demo site for Generate Press. So let's dive into that now. So, if you purchase Generate Press, you can see that there's these awesome website layouts that, that you can import in as demo content when you're starting to make your website. And there's so many good ones on here. I actually use a variety of these on different websites, especially with blog content that I have. And you can get that all for $49.95 and you get a renewal discount each year once you renew the theme. So it's a great deal to take advantage of. And there's so many different themes or demo sites here that you can import on the Generate Press theme. So we're going to take the site from looking like this to importing one of these starter sites or these demo sites here with Generate Press. So let's go into the process. When we're in the dashboard here, we can go to where it says Appearance, Add New, and we're going to just search and put Generate Press in as the theme that we want. We'll install it, and then we'll activate it. I'm just going to deactivate 2019 just out of habit here. I always do that. And now we're left with just the Generate Press theme as our main theme. So if you purchased a premium membership or a premium plan here with Generate Press, you can then log in to your account and download the plugin itself that you're going to need. So you're going to log in up here and then you're going to download the premium version, the plugin here. So once you've done that, you can go over to where it says plugins, add new. And then you're going to go to where it says Upload Plugin, Choose File, and I'll go to my Downloads folder. And here I'll just insert this zip file right here. You do not unzip it. And then you click Install Now, Activate Plugin, and it says Plugin Activated. So if we go over here, let's just refresh, and you're going to see it's slightly different with the new theme in place here. So that's what we have. Now let's say we want to install one of these. I always like using this marketer theme here for blogs. So I'm going to go up here and I'll go to where it says configure and I'll just check all these and then I'll go to activate and then I'll click apply and now we'll activate all these modules and now we have this option up here it says site library. We can click on it and you can literally just scroll through here and decide which one you want to put in. I said marketer. So I'm going to do that. I'll go to preview if you want to preview it again. Details. And here I'm just going to import it. You can back it up right here. And it will give you a file, a JSON file here. And I'll just go to import options. It says checking demo content. I understand that this step will add content, site options, menus, widgets, and so on. So we're going to import it. It's going to import this demo content. It's going to just take a moment to do so. It's pretty quick. And now it says all done. If we click view our site, it will take us to the site. But I just want to refresh it. So this is what we look like over here with just the theme installed. And now with this, we have this demo install content right here for our site from the site library itself. So that's how you add a demo site from the site library in just a matter of a couple minutes and the only other thing I'm going to point out here is if you went back over to Generate Press, you want to be able to update your license key right here, which you can also find within your login back here on GeneratePress.com. You can get that and update your license key for future updates onto the site. So I hope this video was helpful. Feel free to give it a like if it was and consider subscribing to this channel for more WordPress content. Thanks for viewing and have a good one.